Hey guys, it's Bradley for What's in the Box. Thanks for joining this channel. Thanks for checking out this video. So, went to Corvallis, Albany area. I think it was more Corvallis with my mom today to st check out a estate sale that she knew the person that was organizing it. Um, so, went down there Saturday morning, checked it out. Show you what I picked up. Um, show you what I'm keeping, what I'm selling. Picked up this box of clays. I have shotgun, I have 22s, I have uh, other rifles, so clay targets good. Uh, paid two dollars for this, it's about half a box. Um, they had a little bin of free stuff, so I grabbed some free stuff on the way out. I'll show you this. Fala la la llama, thought that was kind of funny. Um, whole bag of wrapping paper and uh name tags or tags and, and bows and stuff that was all free I know that they were just gonna throw that away they were closing up they were pretty much packing stuff up as we were uh, checking out at the end of the day so I knew they were done and they were just gonna throw it away I picked up this old toolbox um, it says six dollars it was half off when we were buying our stuff so only paid three I'll uh, either sell that as is, or maybe I'll clean it up. Not quite sure. So, let's go through the yellow bag I have here on top first, and then we'll go through the other bag down here. I picked up these World's Best Getaways book, but it's not a book. It's a little safe. Um, needs to be re-glued there. No key for it, so I'll have to figure out how much a key is going to cost, or maybe I can find a key that I have that will fit that so I paid a dollar for that I'll resell those those go for about 20 on Amazon brand new uh, my mom grabbed these thinking that would they'd be a good find I said sure you know this is a uh, it's got a little bit of wear a little bit of cracking uh, the cards a little yellow but it's an Austin Powers doll or action figure still sealed but it's trying to separate on the bottom here. But for 10 bucks, it went from 50 down to 45 down to 10 And then it was uh, half off of that. So, 5 bucks for the Dr. Evil. Also grabbed a mini me one as well. Um, it's a little open right here. It's a little split open on the side here. I'm hoping everything is in there. Looks like everything is there. Um, again, five bucks for those. Um, I will probably try to resell those as a bundle. Um, I found this guy. There was no price tag on it. It's got some discolorization, but my buddy's a big Silver Surfer guy. So I picked this up. They wanted 12 Then they said it was half off for 6 I said, pass. I said, how about 3 She said, yeah, I could do 3 So I got that for 3 that's going to a friend. Um, what's in the back here? We got this subway station, Flushing, New York Mets twenty twenty or sorry two thousand World Series envelope. Uh, I don't think there's anything actually in the envelope. I didn't even look. I just thought that was kind of cool. No, it's kind of sealed. I'm not gonna bust it open. Um, nothing inside of it. But I like stamps. I still collect stamps from third grade. So I uh, grabbed that because of the stamp that's on there. I thought that was just something interesting and cool. So there's that. Next. Got a The Life Millennium Lifetime book. I like uh, kind of history books like this. Um, shows you events, reflections of the last you know 100 years or whatever thought that was a kind of cool book i think i paid a dollar for it uh something like that i she didn't even print out a receipt i wish they would have printed out some sort of uh receipt because they were doing it all on a, a square pad uh baseball is america um i figured i'd snag this one and give it to my grandfather he loves reading baseball stuff uh what's this first parachute jump oh someone left their skydiving certificate in the front of it oh two of them it looks like um 
Yeah, there's two people that left their skydiving certificates on here. Whoops. Interesting that they keep them in their book. And then I saw something in the back of this. Uh, I don't know what this is. This is designer store something. Let's see what's in this bag. I did see this when I was grabbing it off the shelf. This doesn't look like it's much. Looks like a receipt for something. Crate and barrel receipt. Someone bought some crate and barrel stuff. That was a lot of money. What is this? I don't know what this is. The Russian anti-guard book. I don't know what that is. Someone had this in the back. Okay, it's interesting. From Crate and Barrel and uh, yeah, okay. Interesting what people put in their books. Come on, separate. Separate, there we go. I'll just put this back in there for now. Because I don't know what to do with it otherwise. And yeah, so I'm going to take this book over. Give it to my grandfather. He loves baseball. Um, I used to watch it a lot. Not as much anymore. There, there's too many dang rules nowadays. And last in here, I almost, my mom missed this. I caught it as I walked by. Um, this is a first day of issue 9-11 tribute stamp and poster. Um, I'm, I'm very sad of what happened that day. I remember listening to it on the radio um, as I was at work and uh, went home and watched it live on TV. It was uh, very traumatic. Um, so I usually get any memorabilia I find at garage sales because I don't want to get this stuff thrown away. I, I think this is some precious stuff. So um, this will be mine. This is staying in my collection. Um, I paid $2, I think, for this. Um, maybe three at the most. I think it was half off. I think they declared it a poster at six dollars marked a half off. So maybe it was two or three. I looked these up on eBay. These sell for about fifty to a hundred dollars. So that's a great score on that one. Okay, so that's uh, bag one. What we got here is next is uh, Miami Jim's sunglass holder or glass holder. It was in the free box. Pick that up. Pick this little ball up for free. Um, I didn't even see this till we were checking out. Craftsman light with battery. Um, works. Not the brightest right now. It's a little dull. I'll have to recharge it. But I have a Craftsman system. So that will work for me. That's perfect. That goes for me. Um, let's see what else I got next here. Another little flashlight. I like flashlights. This one's got a magnetic base. I think I paid a dollar for that. Picked up this signed New York Mets baseball. Not quite sure who the signatures are. I have to do some uh, research into finding out what year these were. Um, they had it marked at 35. Again, it was half off. So there's that one. That one will be up for sale. Picked up some baseball hats as well. Some New York baseball hats they had here. This one's a little bit more worse wear than the other one. So we're going to sell all this probably together. The hats, the baseball, we'll probably do it as a lot sale. What else we got here? What else is down in this bag of goodies I picked up? Um, picked up all three pieces of this uh, hardware when you're doing work around your house. Ten dollars, half off, five bucks. A good deal for me. I'll use that for sure. That that might be mine. Picked up this weird little monkey. It was a dollar. I'm not sure wh quite what I'm going to do with him yet. Not sure what he does. I just thought it was funky. 
sitting on a shelf. Oh, dang. It makes noise. I didn't even realize it makes noise. Okay, uh, Mickey Mouse clock. Missing the battery cover, but that's okay. I, I looked around, didn't see it. Um, again, 20 bucks, paid 10 Disney stuff's always popular. Always good. Picked up some loose action figures down here. I got a, I'm pretty sure this is a spawn cape. I grabbed it with the spawn guy. The hole for it, though, doesn't quite line up, so, um, not quite sure, but I'm, I'm almost positive that's a spawn cape. I'm a spawn guy, but this one might not fit this guy in particular, but I still snagged it together. A little Hot Wheel kind of thought that was a funky looking car. Um, this watch, didn't know anything about it. I think it paid two bucks for it, three dollars maybe. It's kind of weird looking, missing a little rivet it looks like. Uh, picture frame, Hawaiian picture frame, made in Hawaii, eight dollars, I paid four. I've got pictures of when I went to Hawaii with family, so I will probably pick a uh, picture out from that with all the family, print it off, put it in there. We got a preacher back to Texas, uh, trade paperback, I paid a dollar for that trade paperback, pretty good condition. Creature back to Texas. We got a gyroscope. Didn't check if everything's there. Looks like everything is in the box. I'll have to play with that later on. And what else can we get in this box down here? This piece goes to. Uh, we picked up some um, Benoit balls. We got pandas on them. A couple of pandas. So you. Like that. These ones are a little big for my hand. But uh, I've got a couple of different sets of those. Uh, different ones. So I might keep those. Might sell them. I don't know. I only paid uh, $6 for those. And what do we got down here? I picked up this. Uh, this was in the garage. It's a Uline cooler bag. I was just thinking I needed to get a new one because the one I had had a hole in it. So, uh, for eight, half off, four dollars, picked that up. Just realized it was this thing was in there too. This was uh, Elite Pacific Construction. It's like a little zipper pouch. Uh, maybe a zipper or magnet? I'm not quite sure. Maybe it's, uh, not quite sure how that holds together. Maybe there was a clip that was supposed to go on it. But it was in there. So that is the estate hall. Then we drove over to Walport because my mom wanted to go pick up uh, like 20 pounds of halibut. And it went stopped at the store while we were there getting halibut. Found this Jeep Scrambler Baja Blazers. Um, I don't have this one. I'm not sure I might end up selling it to a coworker. That looks for Jeep stuff. I, I should have looked for two of them, but I only I'm pretty sure I only saw one of them. So that is today's haul. Let me know what you think. I think I picked up some good stuff to resell, picked up some good stuff from my collection. Uh, drop a comment down below. Tell me what you think. Peace out, everyone.